This video is a very rough demonstration of how you can import a document from Google Drive into Notability so that you can mark it up in Notability. First, you have to log into your Google Drive account by going into Settings, right down here. Then you have to go into Cloud Services in order to select Google Drive and then select Google Drive and log in using your Dwight Englewood um, username and password you will probably get redirected to Whipple Hill to put in your username follow the same procedure you, you follow generally speaking when you log into Google Drive or, or Gmail to actually import a document into Notability you need to use this import icon right here so the arrow point going into a square thing that represents the iPad. And then you're going to choose Google Drive. After choosing Google Drive, you navigate to your Google Drive folder that has the document you want to import. This may take a little while for it to load if you have a lot of folders, it'll say loading, so you just have to be patient sometimes. Select a document that you'd like to import. Then decide whether you'd like to create a new note or whether you'd like to add this to an existing note. In this case, I'm going to create a new note. If it's a document that has a certain number of pages, you can actually choose how many pages to actually pull in. Most documents, by the way, are converted to PDF files, so they kind of automatically get paginated. And then finally, your document is pulled into Notability. Note that many documents, when they're pulled in, for example, this here was an actual Google, Google document formatted document, it actually gets pulled in as an image, so you can mark it up and um, type in text and annotate and highlight and things like that, but you can't actually edit the text that is there. Um, that could be an advantage or a disadvantage. And that's pretty much it for how you actually import a document into Notability. And you can import a lot of different document types, um, images. PDFs, Word documents, Google formatted, actually Google, native Google documents, at least the word processing documents, and some of the other formats as well. Um, and then you can mark them up. And they pretty much get treated like PDFs once you import them in.